We're obviously um, looking to return the land to at least equal to or better than the land that was here before mining. Um, by the time the mining operation comes down to actually turning over the first set of soil, uh, we have the plans on the table about where we're going and, and what we're trying to achieve at the end. The minerals industry uh, and the energy side of it as well is Australia-wide and working in a company like Colin Allied and, and Rio Tinto, those opportunities coast to coast and worldwide. So, um, Looking beyond the, the square that I'm in now, there's endless opportunities. Uh, where I am based in the Hunter Valley, the majority of people are, are in the minerals industry and if they're like themselves, they're in it because they, they really enjoy it. They enjoy that it is very hands-on. Uh, Mondays are, are totally different days to Tuesdays and Fridays for now. No one day is the same as the next. It's, um, moves very quickly, you obviously as a person need to be able to adapt to change and, and be comfortable that change is going to be part of your your day to day job. And it is the type of industry that welcomes young and, and keen people aboard. Um, that's how we've got to where we are now and we've got a long way to go in the next 10 years, 20 years, 30 years. And if the right keen and enthusiastic people come aboard now that we'll find some answers in the next 10 years to problems or or issues that we can see on the horizon now that uh, we need to address.